Right, the next question is June 08, paper 1, question 2C. A nail gun fires a nail of mass 4 kilograms. Now, it, hopefully you can see from there, 4 kilograms is in bold, and that means that you're going to have to change that into kilograms. So 4 grams has to be changed into 4 kilograms, or sorry, into kilograms. Your total velocity as well, calculate kinetic energy. So kinetic energy, the equation is half times m times v squared. And this is where you have to be careful. Your mass has to be changed into kilograms. So you're dividing it by a thousand and it becomes 0 0.004. And you're multiplying by v squared, which is 30. And don't forget to square it. And your answer comes out to be 1.8. And that's in joules. Now, if you did forget um, to change this, you'll only lose one mark. You get one mark for your equation, um, you get a mark for changing that and multiplying by, by 30 squared. In fact, you get two marks for that and you get your fifth mark for your answer. So you don't lose one mark, you get four out of five, provided you've shown everything else. As the nail enters the wood, it slows to a stop. How much work has to be done by the resistive forces in the wood to stop the nail? So if the, the nail has 1.8 joules of energy, as it's passing into the wood here, it's going to take 1.8 joules of work for the wood to stop it. So the answer is 1.8 joules. The resistive force on the nail, this is part 3, is 45 newtons. Calculate how far into the wood the nail travels. So now we've got how much work is done. We're given how much the resistive force is, is 45 and we're asked for a distance. So you should see there clearly, if you write those three things down, work equals force by distance must be the equation you're going to use. And this is quite a common question, where you're um, slowing something down, therefore its kinetic energy is being converted into the work done by the object which is doing the slowing down, whether that's braking system or wood in this case, or frictional force. And then very often you have to use work as force by distance to calculate a distance, or maybe it's a frictional force you have to calculate. So work is equal to 1.8, and force is 45 times the distance. So the distance is equal to 1.8 divided by 45. Um, and the answer comes out to be 0 0.04 metres. Now that's the same as 4 centimetres. And that sounds about right. If you come up with an answer of 4 metres, you've really done something wrong because there's no way, if you look back up at the diagram again, there's no way that you're going to have a nail going 4 metres into that little bit of wood. It's just not going to happen. Okay, so the answer there is 4 metres. Sorry, um, it's not 0 0.04 metres. OK, it's four centimetres. Um, and so we get one tick for your answer. Um, you get two, you get a tick for that and a tick for that and then a tick for dividing those two.